Yeah, no, he had an amazing year, and I'm delighted for them. As I say, for the number of years they lived in my shadow, not that my shadow was a, was a big shadow to live in, but I'm just saying there was a huge expectation on them. Alan played football for 10 years for Dublin. This is the first all Ireland final he's played, in, and for them to win it, it was just an amazing achievement for them. So I'm delighted for both of them. And we talk about football all right now and, and say I give them advice. I mean, I tell them what I thought, but I mean, at the end of the day, they were playing as part of a team, so I think the advice that I gave them was probably always assumed by the manager that was there at the time, so whether they ever listened or not, I'm not sure. <laughs> they were always very good footballers. They, I mean, as, as juveniles, you could see that they had something that was a little bit different than other guys. I mean, they worked very hard, and the teams in Plunkets that they played, and they would have been the, the strong players in the team, so you always knew that they had... They always knew that they were good footballers. Now, to think that they would win player of the year in successive years, that's just, that's amazing for us. And there's a bit of luck involved in that as well. It was just a great, great year. Well, well, I mean, football is part of our life in the sense that they're playing football all year round. So, you know, their gear is there and so on. So it's, it, do we talk about football or not? Not really, because it's such a big part of our life that when you're sitting down, you're trying to talk about something else. Who were the, I suppose the guys of the 83 team were the Royals. I mean, Alan was born in 82, so the 83 team... See, we, we weren't winning in a lot of all Ireland. We won in 83, won in 95, so unlike Kerry that had all Ireland every couple of years, in a sense, your, your idols become the guys that you see playing when you go to watch them, and we didn't have that many of those guys. So did they have idols in Dublin? I'm not sure, you know.